7A. Welcome, Patriot, to Boston Common. The start of the Freedom Trail. Feast your ears and learn more about the historic Freedom Trail. And learn the history of Boston Common. Tell me about the Freedom Trail. Starting here at Boston Common, follow the red path as it winds its way through our great city's streets. Markers on the trail are placed at many famous historic sites. See Paul Revere's house, the old North Church, the old State House, Bunker Hill, and many more. Four and L. Definitely a code. To admit, I'm very impressed by your performance in the field. We may have a problem here. We're taking too many rads. We need to move out. <laughs> From the nukes. Gonna find you soon, human. Okay. Find me.
over here, back beat. Hey, hold up there. First time in good neighbor? You can't go walking around without insurance. You better back off, or you're the one who's gonna need insurance. Whoa, whoa, hey, all right. We'll just say your insurance is paid up for now, okay? Whoa, 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 time out. If someone steps through the gate the first time, they're a guest. You lay off that extortion crap. What do you care? She ain't one of us. No love for your mayor, Finn. I said let her go. You soft, Hancock. You keep letting outsiders walk all over us. One day, there'll be a new mayor. Come on, man. This is me we're talking about. Let me tell you something. Now, why'd you have to go and say that, huh? Breaking my heart over here. Now, I know you had old Finn handled back there, but a mayor's gotta make a point sometimes. You all right? Your face. Something happened? Like it? I think it gives me a sexy King of the Zombies kind of look. Big hit with the ladies. I'm a ghoul, you see? A lot of walking rad freaks like me around here. So you might want to keep those kinds of questions on the low burner next time. Good neighbors of the people, for the people. You feel me? Everyone's welcome. Of the people, for the people. Oh, brother. <laughs> I can tell I'm gonna like you already. Just consider this town your home away from home. So long as you remember who's in charge. Hey. Go ahead. Paladin Dance. Inquiring about anything in particular? Your thoughts? I think you should stay on point. Your instincts seem to be right on target. Your thoughts? I can count the number of people I can depend on with one hand. You're definitely one of them. How do you feel about our relationship? You're one hell of a soldier, and I'm proud to call you my friend. That was it. Very well. <laughs> oh, look who we have here. I got a like for that. Hey. Hey. What's up? Excuse me. What's up? What a day, huh? <laughs> Everyone's welcome and good neighbor. Even me. Don't you have, like, important things to do? Hi. Nothing more to say. Whoever this Brotherhood of Steel is, I'm not buying that. You come in peace, Malarkey. Whatever. Don't buy it. Our gets eliminated. <laughs> um, I can wait. Stop. Think in a minute. Stay light.
not gonna handicap Paladin though by staying down, so. Oh, I hate getting stuck. Shoot him! Shoot him all! I heard something. Not Bro, past me. I knew. So we. Impressive. Ow. My leg. Don't try Ow. Well, okay. Standing down. You hear that? Yes. Threat neutralized. attention I don't need that I don't know why I picked it up I don't want to get hit by the missile Just getting broken legs all over the place. <laughs> a little man. <laughs> Where is the little man? Don't think we're alone. That was good. We're <laughs> both stupid. <laughs> That's great. <laughs> Stupid little man. <laughs> Go ahead and hide, little bleeder. Ah, oh, I don't know if the missile guy's gone. They're always talking crap. Long live the Brotherhood. You got the other one? He's still moving. I guess we could leave him. 
I mean, it's not like we need him or anything. Where'd you go? Huh? Gotta be a good Keep your weapons. Oh, it is. Going weapons cold. <laughs> I run and hide because I see the missile launcher and you just kill it. Alright. Whatever. I don't want to die. That will definitely take me out. I'm going to wipe you from the face of the earth. That's how we do it in the Brotherhood. Kill them all. Go weapons cold. I know they're still here. <laughs> I know. I'm just shooting. <laughs> Eight D next. One R. Hmm. The trail ends right at the church. Keep up the good what work, the soldier. Heck? Anything useful? Keep up the good work. I even saw him there ahead of time. Excuse me, dog mate. My favorite face. Oh, yeah. These crypts would make an excellent place to seek shelter in the park. <laughs>
This is quite an unusual location. <laughs> Our visual acuity is being reduced to an unacceptable <laughs> level here. It's unacceptable, isn't it? Huh. It spins. Oh, so it starts with R. There we go. Stop right there. You went through a lot of effort to arrange this meeting. But before we go any further, answer my questions. Who the hell are you? Why don't you tell me who you are first? In a world full of suspicion, treachery, and hunters, we're the synth's only friends. We're the railroad. So answer my question. I followed the Freedom Trail, looking for the railroad. I'm not your enemy. If that's true, you have nothing to fear. Who told you how to contact us? I just heard a rumor about you guys in Diamond City. I see. I'm Desdemona, and I'm the leader of the railroad. And you are? Deacon, where have you been? You're having a party. What gives with my invitation? I need intel. Who is this? Wow! Newsflash, boss. This lady is kind of a big deal out there. Sounds like I have a stalker. It's not like that. A lot of people know about you. You saved Amelia Stockton from those maniacs at Covenant. That earns you points in my book. And... as if that wasn't enough... Des, seriously, you haven't heard of her? She's the leader of the Minutemen. It seems like the whole Commonwealth's flying her flag. So, you're vouching for her? Yes. Trust me. She's someone we want on our side. That changes things. So, stranger, why did you want to meet with us anyway? My son, Sean, was kidnapped. I'm looking for help to find him. Someone stole your boy? That's terrible. Do you know who did it? For your sake, I hope the Institute isn't involved. Kellogg kidnapped him. Well, you got your revenge, but that doesn't bring your son back. I'll have Deacon look into this. If anyone can find a lead on your boy, he can. If we're going to be dealing with you, I need to make sure we're on the same page. You know what a synth is, right? Yeah. 
I know all about them. Good. The Institute treats synths as property, as tools. Go on. So we seek to free the synths from their bondage. Give them a chance at a real life. I have a question. The only question that matters. Would you risk your life for your fellow man? Even if that man is a synth? I risk my life for people every day. Makes no difference to me if it's a human or a synth. Well said. We'll do what we can to look into your missing boy. What Eight. the Institute has done to your family Eight. and others is what drives us. Normally, you're exactly the type of person we try and recruit. But right now, we don't have the time to train up a new agent. There are, however, other valuable ways you can contribute. And in turn, we can help you. See Deacon for details. You're free to go. Hi. Hope you didn't mind the reception. When you tango with the Institute, you gotta be careful when someone new gets on the dance floor. Your leader was just being cautious. Caution can often be misinterpreted as hostility. I've seen it happen before. Exactly. Kind of killed our chance at a friendly first impression, though. But it's all good now. I vouched for you. Nobody got shot. Still, I would consider it a close personal favor if you didn't sell us out to the Institute. Thanks. So, tell me, why did you vouch for me? In our little outfit, it's my job to know things. And with everything you've done, it's clear you're capable. A dangerous enemy. And I'm betting, a valuable ally. Probably not. But why the trust? You can't be taking it all on faith. I don't know if we can trust you, but I hope we can. We just survived a hell of a crisis, so we may just be a teeny-weeny bit desperate for new members. If everything was sunshine and bottle caps, we'd probably play a longer getting-to-know-you game. But we don't have that luxury. Really? Is that all? You just don't give up. All right. I have a short list of people I think would be a good fit for our family. You piqued my interest, so maybe I asked around. Did my homework. If you hadn't found us, there's a chance I would have found you instead. Thanks for saving me the trip. So Dez wants me to make you a tourist. That's what we call someone who helps out with the odd job here and there. What a waste. I'm just gonna come out and say this. The railroad needs you. You sure you need me? Desdemona didn't seem to care. She's just thinking of the time and manpower it would take to train you. And if you were some hick from the burbs that didn't know your ass from a rocket launcher, she'd be right. But I'm betting someone like you just needs a few pointers. And a target. You got my attention. I got a job. Too big for me, just perfect for the two of us. You help me out, we turn a few heads, and then Dez invites you into the fold. Then, if you get into a bind and need some help, your buddies in the railroad got your back. What's the job? So, up front, the only thing I'll say is that it's gonna be a wild and dangerous ride but probably nothing new for someone like you. Sign me up, then. Perfecto. Let's meet up at the old freeway outside of Lexington. I'll fill you in once you get there. It's the lighting in here. I want to talk to her. Hey. Saw some of you work along the trail. Not bad. For a human, that is. For a human? What do you mean? You were born in the Wild Human Model 1.0. You ain't bad for that model. Not in the same league as us since, but... Hey, not your fault. Wait, you're a synth? In the artificial flesh. 
And before you start with all the questions, the only thing I'll say about it is this. All those rumors out there are bullshit. I'm as real a girl as you'll ever meet. The only difference is, I bet your assembly instructions were a hell of a lot more fun. Listen, you caught us at a shit time. We're still recovering from something I can't get into. We're a man down, though. And if anything Deacon said about you is true, I'd like you on our team. I'm interested. Awesome. I think you'll be a good fit. I know Dez said we don't got room, but talk to Deacon. I'm sure he's got an angle. He always does. Heads up. All right. Away. Dance. You need to talk? Your thoughts? There's brotherhood, then there's everything else. Nothing in between. Yes, I know. Your thoughts? Call me old-fashioned, but there's nothing better than being boots on the ground. Your thoughts? People in the brotherhood are looking up to you. Keep it up, soldier. Your thoughts? I'm pleased we were assigned to the same team. I think we can learn a lot from each other. Your thoughts? You think we'll actually find anything down here? Your thoughts? You watch my back, I'll watch yours. Your thoughts? Thanks to you, we're making a difference out here. Your thoughts? If we want to win the people's hearts and minds, no. we have to spread the word of the Brotherhood across the Commonwealth. That was all. Not a problem. I'm having a terrible time getting your dialogue to come out places. Get it, dog meat. Can't get in there. 